are recently killing it every week. Doing yeah. really good. Beating players left and right. So we'll see how he does. I like how he slowly adds more letters to his tag. <laughs> so every week it's gotten one extra E. He really wants people to pronounce his name right. <laughs> Eliakim. True, true. Just drop shield just a little too early, but Pyramith were really just chewing him up. Not giving him a moment to breathe. This is where Snake really struggles when he doesn't have time to set up his game plan and run his offense the way he wants to and just take Ooh. that stage control. I just realized he's playing Pyramid there. Pretty <laughs> wise, I guess. <laughs> That's funny. One of the characters I did not mention. Yeah. But it seemed, it seemed to be working, at least in the beginning, but uh, Eli seems to have get, uh, found his footing and getting his game plan rolling. Once he left combo percentage, they're back at the neutral start. Not yep. all the combos you can do with Mithra right now. Um... And the bombs never go away. The, the grenades are forever. A staple of Eli's gameplay <laughs> is grenade play. But I guess that's probably every staple of snake play. <laughs> oh my god, that bomb was. That was a hail. That looked like a Hail Mary, Ooh, but the back air killed. Kills, yes. Pirate killing. Oh, classic. classic. Eli really showing no fear, even though he gets chased. He gets chased going high on the cypher, but he really doesn't. Seem like he cares about it at all because he knows Pyro can't or Pyro or Mithra can't really reach him in there. Not a lot of extra credit from Arrow, but oh, speaking of, got a lot of extra credit now. Yeah, on that. But oh wow, Sneak of Mercy blowing up the grenade. Ooh, yeah. weird Ooh, up team. Must yeah, have been an interesting choice. Swapping back, down throw, grenade. I'm scary about being Mithra yeah. right now. She can die very early compared to. Ooh, power. the down smash just barely getting rolled through. If he actually did it the other way, he would have caught the roll. He sent himself back to stage by holding a nade. Every time I see a snake do like do stuff like that, I'm like, damn, he remembered. <laughs> yeah, what the, yeah, yeah, I remember all that. Uh, it's your job. You picked snake. Oh, try to get uh, the he raw, raw, uh, he raw, just raw does it. He just walked up slowly and up tilted. Snakes love their up tilt. I mean. I do too, and I don't even play Snake. Oh, dash the weak hit a dash yeah, attack. Not getting what he wanted. Yeah. He wanted uh, to go back to running the offense and having uh, that ledge advantage, but dash attack had different arrow. ideas. All the other options were covered, but he rolled. Uh, yep. Here it comes. There's a grenade oh, back okay. here. Yep. Hold shield, hold the grenade, wait for them to make a mistake. Like I said before, there are a lot of characters. Might stay Pyramithra, but I definitely could see a potential switch here. Yeah, Pyramithra didn't seem to get him the advantage that he wanted. It did at the beginning. He showed up with he came up with a lot of momentum moving forward, but it slowly died down as Eli was uh, running through his offense because the the combos didn't quite connect, and Eli was just able to step back and put out the grenades, put all the bombs, and then just wait and then play Snake's game. Uh, often say Pyramid, Sticking to Pyramid. Okay. Yeah. It didn't do that bad that game, so. No, it wasn't bad. Yeah. Definitely not. It's just a few like tweaks here or there to the game plan, and I think he's got it. Oh, Kalos. Okay. Interesting. I guess he wants more run I was gonna say he uh Pyramid probably likes this because he can they can harass Snake off stage when he tries to go high. Using those two outside <laughs> platforms. Eli throwing the grenade, pulling himself up. He's just yeah. giving himself rage. <laughs> yes. That's what he wants you to think. <laughs> nah, he's too good to do anything else. It's on purpose. Everything's methodical. Oh, grenades oh. stop that. The combo. trades. The classic snake trades. Oh, when did he C4 drop that C4? <laughs> Arrow really realizing that chasing Snake up there isn't really going to do him much, but doesn't really know what to do with the time he has on stage in that meanwhile between Snake up B and him landing. Yep, Nikita. Snake classic. Oh, oh what? Is he going to make it back? Oh. No, not quite. Uh, I guess D4 was playing on stage, going to make it back. All right. Yep. Oh. Uh, immediately combo. <laughs> All these He's trades. He's not going to be able to get these Mithra combos with the grenade out. Yup. Although, Arrow, making, Arrow trying to make magic Snake happen. Yup. Snake just... Eli's back. really able to... 
I've seen that Eli's really good, especially when recovering a sneak and understanding where he needs to go and where he needs to be to get through to someone and get back to stage quickly. It's That's always very, a very effective movement when he gets back to stage. Very true. Snake is very vulnerable, when he, especially when he goes high off stage. Mm -hmm. But he understands that going high actually isn't that bad in this matchup because Pyramithor can't go high enough to get him. And it's just a matter of oh. falling. But the shield break comes out. This isn't going to be good. Yep. All right. How much extra credit can you get, Arrow? Not much. Actually, none. All right. We have 0-0. Zero, zero. Whoever plays better this time will win it. Oh. Clashing with the grenade. That's actually an interaction I've never seen before. Going high. It didn't go high enough. He's able to get chased out. Oh my god. Big damage. How, Big damage. What is. Where are these grenades coming from? He's, he's attacking actively. Because in at least one frame, so they can take it out. I guess, yeah. It's like seeing Shulk switch to shield art mid combo. Oh, interesting choice with Arrow. I think that was Ooh, a missing play. Very good uh, B yeah, reverse. Trying to call out his any option. Is that kill? Oh, not quite. This is scary for the both yeah. players, actually. Although I think Snake is, is in a good position. I said that right before he almost died. And the up airs in the deal. Yep. One one. So, banning against Snake, so difficult. Every time I play Snake, I'm like, what do yeah. I ban? Snake loves PS2. You're going to ban that. Snake loves Smashville. You're going to ban that. But then he has small <laughs> battlefield right after, and that's always the pick. You're going to ban PS2 and Smash Smashville. He's going to go small battlefield right after. That's where we are right now. Yep. I mean, it, it just makes sense. It's just Snake is such an odd character to play and fight that... There's no, there's no like guide on how to do it because Snake's so aw awkward with all of the explosions on stage, and he's completely fine trading because of how heavy he is. So you can't even just say tr get him to trade more. Although we see Eli's rolling a little, rolling a little bit more than he normally does. Seems like he's a small amount afraid. Oh, huge damage. For Absolutely. Arrow. F2. If he, if he can get the kill soon, it'd be so big. Yup. Going high. Going high. Good wave bounce. Right out the ledge. He, the, the Cypher to get the C4 out is an interesting choice, but I don't see it working out well for him when he's done it these couple of times. Although I might have... Okay, I was going to say, I might have to eat those words. That's not killing. Not on Snake. Only shield, full rage, so... Very awkward position. Yeah. You want to get those kill hits, but he's going to keep shielding, holding grenade, and you'd think like, you go what for do you a really, grab, but yeah, how can you really Pyro do doesn't have a lot of good that. kill grabs, or doesn't have a kill throw. And, and not at this percent, anyways. <laughs> Only 176. Oh. Ooh, the F-Tilt missed. That would have been Death so tech missed bad. too, or got shielded. Would have been so bad for Arrow. Oh, okay. Eli realizing that the shield is his best friend in the matchup. And that arrow really doesn't have that no. much to get through it. Or I should say Pyro Mithra. Pyro or Mithra can't really do much off of the shield, especially when they're trying yeah. to kill him outright. So Arrow's getting pretty antsy here for the kill. Oh, he gets the kill. He got it. But he took 46% for it. Let's see what yeah. he can make up for it with Mithra combos. I mean, it's nothing set in stone. Good tech read. The trade, the trade actually not oh, that bad for Arrow, but that way. was. What was that angle? Sneak going high. Here comes the C4. Oh no, the air dodge. He's gonna die off Up that. Smash? Yep. Oh. I was wondering when uh, Eli was gonna use that C4, but it wasn't really coming out. There's the up tilt, up -tilt. just land in front okay. of him up tilt. This is even. Anyone's game, anyone's set. Truly. This is a huge, this would be a huge win for Arrow. Especially against Eli. Eli, strong player. Okay. Eli, strong player, doing really good. It'd be, it'd be crazy to send him this, the early, this early. <laughs> the swap was an interesting nice choice. Tilt.
88. Constant explosion. Sneak off stage is gonna go high. Ooh, he went low. Yeah, gotta recover from Eli. Yep. Very good choice to go low that time, using the cipher to try to stuff the ledge uh, options. But does he die off that? Not quite. Oh, oh my didn't god! The C4 was there. I didn't Sneaky either. Kill from Eli. He stole that. <laughs> Always gotta keep track of your C4s. I. We just saw a prime example of why.